testing out our air mattresses just to make sure they didn't have any leaks before we went camping. And I noticed something that was really interesting in how they designed these air mattresses. I was getting ready to let the air out and noticed there's actually a smaller valve and a bigger valve. And so I opened up the small valve and none of the air came out, which was a little bit frustrating because I was trying to deflate it. Um, but I started to wonder why none of the air was coming out. And so I opened up the bigger valve and look at how cool this design is once I get it open here. You can hear the air coming out now and um, look at this flappy thing. It has this flappy thing and when the mattress is full of air, the air pressure pushes it closed so it's not going to leak. The smaller valve here that if you are needing to reinflate it, the air pressure from you pushing air in is going to push that flap out of the way and let you inflate it a little bit more. But after you close the big valve, the air pressure is going to push that flappy thing closed and it's not going to let any of the air out. And that's why it wasn't leaking when I was trying to open it and deflate it with just the small valve. So I just thought that was some really fun everyday science. What are you going to discover this week?